this one in the air out to left. And he will run this one down. A good read off. Now at the plate, Reggie Larson. he look to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Hit on the ground toward the left. And that's through for his first base hit in this one. Cutting it close here, but he comes through in the eighth to extend his hitting streak. Yeah, and he was staring at his last at bat right there. Probably his last at bat. Would have been tough to get him another A-B in this one, but he's able to get it done. Hey, better late than never. I'm... Shinji Tatum will stride in again as he looks to join a very elite list. We take you back to earlier. This was home run number three in the ball game as they'll try and join just a select few with four home runs in a single game. First offering on its way. Line drive to left. Larson is there and they go down in a hurry here as his side is quickly retired. Giants are down on four pitches. They lead it, however, it's six to five. Leading off the inning, Josh Rutledge, as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. Hit in the air out to straightaway left field. Tatum is there, and that's not the start to the bottom of the ninth. This crowd was hoping. Man, that's what you would call an efficient outing. One pitch, and he gets the save. He doesn't get paid by the pitch, so he just figured he'd end it quickly and hit the showers. Good call. And tonight's one-run game comes to an end, 6-5, to five, the final. San Francisco get the win on the heels of four home runs. Erasmo Ramirez earns his first win of the season. Felix Pena hammers down the save, his first of the year. So that's a wrap here tonight. Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Matt Vaskersian, we're all thanking you for watching Major League Baseball on MLB Network. Have a great night. Final line score tonight. Well, the Santa Ana winds are kicking, leaving us nothing but clear skies over Dodger Stadium in L.A. Today, game three of this four-game weekend set between the San Francisco Giants and the Los Angeles Dodgers. Major League Baseball on MLB Network is next. Jake Junis, a right-hander from Illinois, will be the starter here. Dan Plezak, what do you got? Hey, you don't see a lot of guys that have five pitches, right? Sometimes it's hard to master even two or three. But if you can master five like he had... Take this one to the bag for the out. But meanwhile, the runner will move up 90 feet to third base. And here's how the visiting San Francisco Giants line up in this one. How do they go about taking down their division rival, Mark DeRosa? Matty, this lineup... Pen for a home run. A solo home run off the bat of Josh Rutley. First home run of the campaign for him. And the Dodgers are within a run. It's now 2-1. to one. Well, he was over in the series before that blast, so that's just about as welcome a sight as he could hope for. He got a pitch to his liking and took out a lot of frustration with that swing. Into the box now, Shinji Tatum. Over one here in the early going. Shinji Tatum. First pitch of the at-bat. Swing and a ball yanked down the right field line. And it looks like he'll have extra bases here to begin the third. He'll get it into second, but he'll be in there with a double. And the screen shows the story right there as that hitting streak will live to see another day.
And that'll bring up Jorge Bonifacio, looking to follow up the RBI single from his first at-bat. And the runner's breaking for third. On the back, pick up the ball. hard on the ground to second. Rutledge is there. And that's out number one. But one's all they get as the run scores. Digging in for his second at-bat, Cody Bellinger. He drew a walk his first time up. Cody Bellinger. He takes it to the opposite field, high and deep to left. Tatum going back, and this is off the fence right in front of the Dodger bullpen. Now the relay home. And the ball's waiting for him, and he's out at the plate as he pretty much just ran out of gas out there. Ready for another shot now. Shinji Tatum will try to follow up the double in his last at-bat with another big hit right here. He's ready. Here's the first offering. High and deep to right. Santana looks up. Gone! A two-run blast to straightaway right field. Sixth home run on the season for him. And just like that, it's now a 5-2 ball game. Guys, we've seen four big balls between the two teams so far today. What are your impressions of the long ball display we're watching? Hey, thanks, Matt. Yeah, you know what, Dodger Stadium is... Ready to take his hacks again. Shinji Tatum, as he'll look to follow up the two-run homer he launched over the wall last time up. And that last at-bat when he went deep, he turned around a pretty good fastball. So I'm kind of thinking this guy's a good fastball hitter. So I might want to move that ball up and down and in and out and try not to throw it right down the middle of the plate. Drops in a strike to start the at-bat. Nothing in one. You know, you look at this hitter, he doesn't care about being down 0-1. He doesn't care about having two strikes with him. He's got the utmost confidence in his ability to work back into the count and get him something over the heart of the plate. 0-1 count, here's the pitch. Now he goes the other way, and he got a lot of it high and deep to left center field. Heredia is going to get back, and he'll put this one away on the warning track for the first out. Had a long way to go to make that running catch, and here it is again with the show track numbers. Took a great angle at it, showed nice closing speed, and ended up running close to 110 feet to finally bring it in. No doubt an effort. Josh Rutledge will stand in again as we flash you back to the early stages of this ball game. There were fans still finding their seats as he launched his second home run of the game as he was off to a fast start indeed. Well, that'll stay in the park as it's off the left field wall. Heredia rounds the corner and is headed home. He'll score easily as they extend their lead to two. Dan, that's a huge insurance run right there. Has to feel good as a hitter right there to not only get a ribby knock, but to give your team a little bit of breathing room. It, it does, and to make sure pitcher go out there with a little bit more free and easy frame of mind instead of going in a one-run game where every pitch is so important, you're one pitch away from us. Digging in to try it again. Shinji Tatum. He flew out in his last at-bat. First delivery to him on the way. Swing and a drive to right. There it goes. And that one is gone. A two-run blast to straightaway right field. His second home run of the game as this lead has been sliced down to two. Wow, nine home runs. d Road Dan, when's the last time you saw a power performance like this from two competing teams? Dan, although the wind's blowing in right here... And a nice job here to come in and slam the door. That's his first save of the season, but it certainly won't be his last. Nine to seven, the final score in this ball game. 
the Dodgers wrote an important sixth inning to victory in this one. Yimi Garcia claims the win out of the pen his first. So that'll just about do it for us this afternoon. Thanks to Mark DeRosa, Dan Plesak, and the rest of our crew. This is Matt Vaskersian, and you've been watching a presentation of MLB Network. See you next time. My player is not a fielder. It's a cute hitter. And best hit hitter. But I'm in charge of fielding. And see what guys like. You guys like to see him. He's left him. They left him. Nine Four out. Well, the Santa Ana winds are kicking, leaving us nothing but clear skies over Dodger Stadium in L.A. Today we wrap up this four-game weekend series between the San Francisco Giants and the Los Angeles Dodgers. It's baseball on MLB Network, and it's coming up next. Lorne Michaud will be on the mound for the boys in blue. Dan Plezak, what's the word on him? Hey, it's hard to have all four of your pitches on, but I think if this guy can have two or three of his four pitches and have command of them, he's going to have a really good game. Digging in the switch hitter, Shinji Tatum. He'll swing it from the left side right here. Tatum. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. But it bends just foul into the second deck. Here it comes. Oh, my. This ball is crushed. Where will this one end up? Out of here. Into the visitor's bullpen. A solo shot down the line in right. Eighth home run on the season for him as the Giants are stink to a 1-0 lead. That ball was absolutely blasted. 113 miles an hour off the bat according to show track. As you see the distance there, that's one that'll get people talking. Not even far. I could hit farther than that. Here's Cody Ashey as they'll have five, Three six, and seven here to start the home half of the Third second. Cody Ashey. The 2-2. Two -two. It's a high drive to left. Back toward the wall, but he's going to run out of room. It's gone! Cody Ashey with a solo home run. First home run of the campaign for him. And the Dodgers are back even now. Oh, with one of these. There's some players. Certainly a tape measure shot there as we take a look at it with our show track technology. 111 miles an hour was the exit velocity, so it comes as no surprise that it carried as far as it did. 140, 430 feet. Coming to the plate now, Josh Rutledge. Past meetings against Lance McCullers. He's just two for nine. He's also gone down on strikes five times. Lifted in the air to straightaway left. Tatum is there. Two, two, two. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. It, it. Here's Corey Seeger. Santana stands at second with no outs. Santana, Santana, Santana. Lifted the other way down the left field line. 
Tatum sprinting after it. He makes the catch, and the runner from second will tag and hit for third. And he'll make it up to third safely here with one away. Trying to pick things up where we left off. Cody Ashy. he went deep in his first at bat. We'll see what he's got in store for us here. Yeah, that last at bat, Danny, he did turn that fastball around. He didn't wow. hit it a ton. He didn't hit it a country mile. But, hey, listen, a home run is a home run. This is in the air to left. Tatum has a play. And that's the third out. The sights and sounds of a day at the ballpark. Oh, my goodness. More to come on MLB Network Sunday Baseball oh, after this. Oh, man, she go to freaking... She go to uh, Los Angeles. Riding in Los once Angeles. again, Shinji Los Tatum. Angeles, as uh, the switch hitter will take his cuts no and man. hand it here. Yeah, and it's right. Toronto Blue Jays, where is that, man? The fans are looking good. It'll be interesting this day to see if they give him a steady diet of fastballs. Pay my mortgages and my bills and my First delivery to him on the way. Ground ball to second. This could be two. Fielded by Rutledge. On to first, and they get the play. Home run he hit earlier. First pitch coming, here it is. Swing and a drive to right. There it goes. And as Giants fans here on television, it is out of here. A solo shot here to straightaway right field. His second of the game. And the Giants have come back to knock this one up at two apiece. Sort out your life, man. I'm sure you know it's coming after that bomb. That's right. Let's check it out on show track. And as the numbers come in, we see it was projected at over 450 feet. An incredible home run to watch. 152 feet. That's probably like one of the... It's on top there. The most... The Stepping in and ready for another shot. Josh Rutledge. Rutledge. And a pivotal moment in this feet. one. Tie ball game. Base is loaded. But the possibility of an inning-ending double play does still exist here. The 2-2. Two -two. It's a high drive to left. Back toward the wall. But he's going to run out of room. It's gone! So one swing, and he unloads the bases on that one as they what? open it what up to Bellinger? six to two now. He's on that team. Well, we've now seen four homers combined between these two clubs today. What are your thoughts, guys? Yes. Matty V is just that? one of those days where the ball seems to be fine, Dero. The hitter's on point. The pitchers aren't making very good pitches. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. It's all about executing pitches, and they're not doing it today. They're leaving a lot of balls over the heart of the plate. And this offense is both Pump offenses it. are taking advantage. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. Tatum will range to his left as he tracks this one down in left center. Ready once again, Shinji Tatum comes in two for three with a couple of home runs thus far on his line. Yeah, man, this guy flexed his muscles in that last at bat. We heard that he has good power. That last bomb had to go well over 400 feet. He hit it a long way. And he might have another one as this is hit high and deep out to left. A leap, but he can't rein it in. It's off the wall. He hit the corner and tries for third. And he's out at third. Might have gotten a little greedy that time. Oh, you hate to see guys run into outs, especially when it's because of an unnecessary risk. He had two all the way, and he clearly should have just been happy with that. Hey, one of the keys to having a good record in baseball is to win some games at home. They don't give you a manual, but you give you a manual like online, but... They just give you like a full book or like a manual. Sometimes it has to be like a full book. That's right there. At least a simple manual. Not too simple, but just simple.
games remaining. One game left. What time is it? Seven forty seven. Seven forty seven in AM here. Sorry for the, the delay, I'm just trying to figure out some stuff here. Even my 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 player just kind of pissed off. Just look at my my player. Now he's happy, but. Before he was pissed off, like I wonder how the hell you're supposed to like get a a to ninety nine contact and left contact.
manager and accepted playoff MVP. MVP. Congrats to you on your beat game playoff MVP. With all your work and the clutch, you easily deserve it. <laughs> One more hole oh, in the World Series MVP. It's no shock we won the World Series considering how it's breaking. You deserve to capture the World Series and the new trophy. Whoa. I've been holding this. I've been holding this since I don't know. God knows when. Ballinger, uh, Wade Ballinger, Dodgers. He scares the shit out of me. Get me out of here.
player receives a check-in from one of his coaches. Effortlessly. The morning fog yet to go away, so we're left with overcast skies here at AT&T Park. Today, it's the home opener for this new season.
between the Seattle Mariners and the San Francisco Giants. Folks around here in high spirits. Matt Vaskersian with you on a day that's been circled on their calendars since about midwinter. I'm joined by Dan Plezak. And Dan, as we get things going this season, it's pitching that has to be key if this team's going to have success. Hey, just like any team, pitching is going to be the key factor for this ball club as the year. I'm sure the staff will have its ups and downs, but putting together some quality outings early in the season could do wonders for this club getting out of the gate with a good start. Quickly now, we'll look at the two men who'll get the starting assignment here in this home opener. Coming to the plate now, Shinji Tatum. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. First offering on its way. Line to the right side. Henniger back in plenty of time to put this away, however, and there are two gone. Digging in now for the Mariners, Ben Gamel, 7 8 9, bottom of the order set to go here in the third. That's a hit, the first of the game for the Mariners. He's around first, heading for two. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. That's how quickly things can change in this crazy game. The pitcher was upset about the call in the previous pitch, which could have been strike three. Then he serves up one for a double. Good example of why you have to have a short memory in this game. You let those things get to you, and oftentimes they lead to more. Ready for another chance. Shinji Tatum. He'll swing it from the left side right here. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Takes a look at one catching the outside corner. Oh, one count. Here's the pitch. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Henniger is back to the track as he takes it for out number two. That's one of those tough luck outs that'll drive you crazy as a hitter. He drove that fastball but couldn't get it down, so he has to take hard contact as a consolation. Next for Seattle, Robert Geary. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Here now the 2-2. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Tatum is after it. One away. Stepping into the box, Ben Gamble. It was a double for him in his first turn at the plate. This game is rolling right along as we move into the middle innings with no score. You'd think by now one of these two teams would be able to get some base runners on and get him in, but that hasn't been the case. And that'll get down out there near the wall. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. Left fielder really never had a chance at that one at all. It was over his head before he knew it, bouncing off the base of the wall for an easy double. Those are the kind of shots anyone would feel good about. Here now is Mike Zanino. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. The one two left side. Oh, what a play! It's in time. Oh, that's just an excellent play that time. Super high degree of difficulty on that one. And as an added bonus, not only does he get the out at first, but he also keeps that runner stationed on second base. 
Here's D. Gordon now, runner in scoring position with two guys. The 1-1. One, one. Smoked on the ground, left side. And that's through into left, a base hit. The runner from third crosses the plate, and they've taken a 1-0 lead. Boy, it's been tough to score in this one so far through the fifth inning, but that RBI base hit right there is a nice breakthrough. Yeah, it's been a great pitcher's duel up until this point. They've been executing on the bump without question, but that RBI not. So in now for San Francisco, Shinji Tatum as the switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Drilled to the right side. And that's through for a hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. And as you see right there, that'll push his hitting streak yet another game as he has been on fire this month. And that'll bring up Jorge Bonifacio. No hits in two trips to the plate for him in the ballgame. On its way, the 0 1 pitch. Hit it out, hit it out, hit it out. And that's through into right field for a base hit. Throw oh, comes yeah, in quickly yeah, here, yeah. and that'll prevent the runner at third from testing things here. The tag, and they got him coming back to third. Next to hit will be the pitcher, Andrew Moore. He struck out and flied out. 0 for 2 so far. I saw him going to the, the home base. Here comes the 0 1. And he takes a big swing at that one as this one's lifted high in the air and deep out to left field. Into the bleachers and gone. A solo shot here to left. First home run of the campaign for him as the Mariners have opened up a 4 to nothing lead. Wow, not every call is going to go your way. And there are some pitchers that pitchers think are pitchers' pitches, and you don't get that, and it puts you in a bad spot. And you can tell that it affected him. So that brings up the always intense Matt Chapman. Previously against Vizcaino, he hasn't had much success, just two for 11. Line drive this hit. Hey, no runner, no runner. Well, that's not a bad pitch right there. That's a pretty good sinker. He just happens to hook that one right into left field for a base hit. Yeah, he got the bat head out right there, Dan, and was able to get that one to left field. Training, man. Digging in and looking for more. Shinji Tatum. He singled his last time up. First delivery to him on the way. Oh, my, this ball is crushed. Where will <laughs> this one end up? And splash down. It's into McCovey Cove. A solo shot down the line in right. Number 10 for him on the year. As they get on the board, it's 4-1 to one now. Well, they're still down, but this homer right there might light a fire under the whole team. Give them a spark to climb back into this thing. We'll see if this gets them going. Well, in a quick series like this, you take the first one, you're guaranteed at least a split. They'll take that every single time. And the score finishes 4-1 to one today. The M's used a nice fifth inning to take the lead, and they never gave it back. Andrew Moore earns his first win of the season. Mike Clevenger closes the door for the save, his second. So that just about does it. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Pleszak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way on over to theshownation.com.
Seattle. Oh, this is pretty close to Seattle. Our final line score this afternoon. First for the victorious Seattle Mariners. Four runs on ten hits. No errors. They left nine runners on base. And I saw the Seattle Mariners. Uh, Rain field. coming down here in San Francisco's field, China but, uh, Basin as we're at AT&T Park. Today, the finale of this oh, quick two-game series between the Seattle Mariners and the San Francisco Giants. Interleague Baseball comes uh, your way first next. First time in my life ever seen uh, uh, Scott Rosales is part. on the mound for game two. Dan Plezak, what's the word on him? Hey, this guy yeah, wasn't too bad in this last one, normal, Matt. Pitched man. all the way through the yeah, sixth inning. And listen, that's what you ask for nowadays. If you can get your starter to get you through the sixth inning and turn it over to the bullpen, he took the loss in the last one, but he actually pitched pretty well. Sliding into the box, D. Gordon. And we are ready for some daytime baseball. D. Gordon. Now the one and one pitch. Hit in the air out to straightaway left. Tatum has him played perfectly as he puts it away for round number one. A moment now to give you a look at the Mariners' starting lineup. Mark DeRosa, what's your take on him this afternoon on the road? Matty, these are the lineups you want to be in. Driving to the ballpark, you got a cup of coffee in your hand, you look at the flags and they're blowing straight out. You're running to the manager's office if your name's not in the lineup. It just takes one grain on that bat. Next to bat for the Giants, Shinji Tatum. He was responsible for the only run they could muster in yesterday's ball game. It was a solo shot. First pitch coming. Here it is. And that one right down Main Street. Fellas, the Mariners entering play here this afternoon. It's been a promising start to the new year as they've taken three of the first four contests. Yeah, Matty, they started this road trip off right. Yesterday, there was one common theme. There was great starting pitching. Guy went out and absolutely executed. Hopefully he passes Whoa. the baton to this guy today and he goes out and follows suit. Great on it, but it was good contact. Here it comes, 0-2. A line shot to third base, but the runner is back in time to avoid the double play. And here's a look at the hometown Giants starting lineup in this one. Dero, what's your take as they look to end their losing streak? Matty, this lineup is built on one thing, and that's moving the ball over the fence. This is a station-to-station -station team. Now at the plate, D. Gordon. He flew out in his last at-bat. The 2-2. Hard ground ball to third. A diving effort as it's off his glove. And not really much of a chance to recover there as he'll reach first on what undoubtedly will be scored as an infield single. So striding in, Robert Geary will try to follow up the double in his last at-bat with another big hit right here. Set, here's the 3-1. Swung on and hit in the air to left. Tatum is in pursuit. Makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. Mariners leave a couple. We'll go to the bottom of the second. No score. Stepping up to the plate, Shinji Tatum. 0 for 1 here in the early going. Shinji Tatum. It's time to do some clutch. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. But that'll hit off the wall in left center. Around yeah. second. He's on his way to third. The relay. Well, he is in there with a triple. And you see on the graphic right there that his hitting streak will indeed live on as he just continues to hit the ball well. And that'll bring up Jorge Bonifacio. They've got two already home in the inning and a potential third waiting in the wings only 90 feet away. 
B. Oh, and one delivery. Target ball to short. Throw to first is in time, but meanwhile, the runner is in to score. Two runs already home, and now you can make it three. Good job right there of keeping it simple and putting the ball in play. Next up is the sneaky pop of Nicky Delmonico. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Hey, we're still in the early stages of this one. They're only down by a couple of runs. But it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. And that'll get by and on through towards the wall. And the Mariners have something going right away. It's a leadoff double. Man, that's got the sting for the pitcher and his teammates. They just get on the board and are feeling good about themselves, looking for a shutdown inning so they can get some more runs on the board. But instead, this guy blasts a leadoff double. So that brings up the always intense Matt Chapman. He struck out swinging in his last trip to the Matt plate. Matt Chapman, you going down, I will break you. Bullshit. This is line to left. Oh, and he misses it. He threw first and hustling for second. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. Man, I can't believe that just happened. And I bet neither can he. He was tracking this line drive all the way, I thought. But then it flies right past him. He looks back and there's no help coming. He has to retrieve it himself. Got to oh, wonder if he lost sight of it at the last second I or something. Got that, man. So digging in now, Shinji Tatum. Shinji Tatum. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. No balls and a strike to count. I know it's a guessing game, but usually when you flip that coin, it better come up fastball at this level. You cannot be late right there. That was right in the wheelhouse. Hey, he looked like he was a little bit out in front on that breaking ball right there. The body can go a little bit. If he was able to keep his hands back a little bit, he might have been able to do some damage with that fist. Geary is camped under this one. As he puts this one away, the side is retired. Giants down in order, and it remains a 3-2 ball game. Coming to the plate now, yeah, Shinji Tatum. He'll swing it from the left Shinji side right here. The of the Ready with the first pitch, here it comes. And he turns this one around oh, high and deep to center yeah. field. And he dives to make a spectacular oh. catch. What a play there to end the inning. Worth a second look here as this is a beauty to end the inning. More matinee baseball here on a Wednesday afternoon following this. Oh, he scraped his dick all over the, all over the ground. Now back to the top of the lineup, now stepping back. in, D. Gordon. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. Oh, he has a job? Hard on the ground towards short. Great effort on the dive, but it's through. You're usually in this situation looking for a bloop and a blast. He didn't want to bloop it, and he hit a missile, bringing the tying run to the plate. Let's see if they can capitalize. Now at the plate, Mitch Hanniger. He was retired after popping out in his last at-bat. Last chance for the Mariners. Hit sharply on the ground to the left. And the inning will continue as that's through for a two-out hit. And if you're the manager, you've got to love that about your team. They were down to their last strike, but they refused to go down without a fight, so they lived to fight some more. I can't wait for hockey, man. Coming hockey. to the plate now, Matt Chapman. Runners on first and third, two away. There's some baseball, dude. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Tatum giving chase. Makes the catch, and that's the ball game. And a nice job here to come in and slam the door. That's his first save of the season, but it certainly won't be his last. Four to two, the final score today.
the Giants led this game from the third inning on and never wavered. Scott Rosales gets the win on the mound his first of the year. Trevor Rosenthal earns the save out of the bullpen his first of the year. So that's it for us this afternoon. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Pleszak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, log on to theshownation.com. Time of the ball game, two hours and 48 minutes. Our paid attendance this afternoon, 41,503. The Giants thank you for attending today's game at AT&T Park and remind you to please buckle up and drive home safely.
It's a cold night at AT&T Park in San Francisco, conjuring now distant memories of the stick. Tonight, the first of this three-game weekend series between the L.A. Dodgers and the San Francisco Giants. Shinji Tatum aims to bring his hitting streak to 25 straight games right after this. Erasmo Ramirez, the Nicaraguan-born pitcher, gets the call to start in this one. What's your take on him, Dan? Hey, this guy has really good stuff. And when he's commanding his off-speed pitches like he was in his last one, he threw the ball really well, picking up the win and allowing only two runs. If he brings that stuff back in this one, it could be back-to-back -back powerhouse performances. Left fielder. At the plate, Shinji Tatum. Not to jinx him or anything, but he'll be looking to lengthen his hitting streak here. And you get above 20 games, you start thinking about it every at-bat when you take that donut off on the on-deck circle. 25 games, now you're starting to get into some rarefied air. Giants are down one, two, three. We are still scoreless. Into the box now, Reggie Larson. He successfully laid down a sack bunt in his last plate appearance. The one-two. Line drive to left. But he'll hardly need to move out there in left as this is hauled in for the first out. Plate, Shinji Tatum. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Things not looking very good so far in this one, but we're still in the middle innings. They're down by a couple of runs, and this would be the right place and the right time to get something going. The last thing they want to do is to try to come from behind. There's a swing and a drive, and everybody's just going to sit back and watch that one fly. A no doubt home run. shot here to straight away right field number 11 for him on the season and the Giants have struck for a run it's now a two to one ball game no doubt an impressive home run so we'll employ show track for a more in-depth look 112 miles an hour was the exit velocity off the bat, so it's no wonder why it ended up having the impressive distance that it did. <laughs> Ready now, Shinji Tatum, as the switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. And this is the side of the plate this guy loves to hit at. Hitting over 350 left-handed, hitting against right-handed pitching. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Fouled off. And this is sliced hard down the left field line. And that is down for extra bases as this will get one home and maybe two. And the runner will score back, from second. Ball, and a ball. relay to the plate. And he will beat the tag at the plate. With that base hit right there, d -Row, that's his third RBI of the game. More importantly, his team's now ahead. Yeah, these are the special ones. He's had a great... Swing and a miss, and that ends the inning. Some of our nation's young minds and future leaders here in attendance. Yikes. We're back to Friday Night Baseball on MLB Network after this. Next up for Los Angeles, Domingo Santana. He'll start things out in the sixth for a lineup that really hasn't found its groove in this one. Yeah, only two hits so far, Matt, and not very many hard-hit balls either. We'll see if they can start making some adjustments. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. And this one is gone, a home run. It's a solo shot here for Domingo Santana. He here in the early as it's trimmed to a 